There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Welcome to InThisCornerTV.com. I'm Smitty. He's light heavyweight king Chad Dawson. He takes on Jean Pascal. Uh, August the 14th on HBO. Kind of home cooking for him. He's yeah. a Haitian, but he, he lives in, in, in Canada. What do you know about Pascal? Son, Jean Pascal, what do I know about him? Uh, short, compact fighter. You know, um, I don't really know much about it. I haven't really watched him fight. I seen him fight Diakonu the second time, which wasn't, I didn't really see much. You know, I seen both of them fought a hell of a fight, but, you know, I'm, worried, I'm just focused on what I have to do to win this fight. and. Everything, I, all the thing I have to do to win the fight is use my height, my reach, my power, and just, you know, outbox them. The things that have brought you 29 victories. Exactly. Oh, tell us about this particular training camp. Eddie seems very happy with it. Yeah. We came into camp, you know, we know what we had to do, like every kid, we know what we got to do, we know what we're going up against. You know, it's always good to know what you're going up against and knowing and having the confidence to go in the ring and apply what you, what you can do with your training. So, you know, I brought my strength and condition trainer back, Axel Murillo. You know, and everything's been going perfect. John Pascal, what do you know about this young man? He's from Haiti, but he lives in Canada, so he's going to have some home cooking going on. You know what? This is what I'm worried about because I've seen what the people, the, when I say the people, the judges, the referees, I see how they protect their guys. I mean, they protect Lucien Boutte, who was all but out when he fought Lebrado Andrade. And they gave him the extra, extra long count and, you know, got it and dropped it to the corner, then got him to another corner, and they were still counting. You know, so I see how they protect those guys. That's what I'm worried about. I'm not worried about Pascal. I'm worried about the judging and the referees. That's all I'm worried about. So going into it with that mindset, what do you tell your fighter to do? Win one round at a time with it decisive. And, and look great, sharp doing it. No, nah, that doesn't concern me. And, you know, it might concern you know, think promoters and things like that. But I know what I, I know what I have to do. I know what I can do. And if I have to put them down, I know I can put them down. Left, left uppercut, left. Boom, double hook, short, short. Just turn it. Boom, 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 boom. There you go. Come back. Ready? Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Nice and compact. All your shit is right here. Nice and compact. Drop it off and step around. Ready? Drop it off. Step around. Go. Boom, 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 boom. Step. Uh huh. That's what I'm talking about. Perfect. Perfect. All the 14th of HBO, you're gonna see a pure boxer, a pure puncher. You're gonna see everything. You know, like I said, this is a great camp. You know, we did everything right. We did everything we had to do. And like I said, John Pascal is no threat to me. He's no threat to the U.S. You know, so I'm going into this like we're going, like we're going to USA versus Canada. You know, and we're gonna drop bombs on them. And I will personally guarantee that, that he had a tougher time with me today than he'll have with Pascal August the 14th. Best of, best of luck, champ. Thank you. <laughs> it's a good workout. Yeah. <laughs> uh -oh. Wrong way, Smitty. Wrong way. Cut. You're not supposed to cut the ring off on me, man. Damn.